Sicilianus is uh, my birth name. In my religion here, it's uh, the scent of protecting babies. I took everything from my father. He is a great, great bridal couturier in Crete. So this is what I took from. I start doing it and I still have my clients. I love them. My first personal uh, collection I showed to Athens Exclusive Designers Week was on March. I showed my fall winter 2012 collection. So this was my first attempt to go a little bit more further than bridal. I choose to see it like art, not Greece, not Europe, not uh, anywhere. I prefer to focus art and do art and that's all. I was playing music, uh, I was playing to the theater. Uh, I want to combine it personally my collection with my performance on playing the guitar live. It's something I got yesterday night after I was awarded like a best designer, best new designer here. And uh, I had that flash on my mind while we were parting my victory, let's say. And I said, guys, uh, next show I will uh, perform my skills on playing music. I don't know if it's because of my father. I was used to sketch dresses when I was young. I studied economics, something very, very different. I work as a broker. Uh, I work as a economic counselor. My first experience, of course, was in my father's atelier. I was working as a helper, all the, the kid for all the work around, you know. After I started to Pansik, Scuola di Moda is a Italian style Greek fashion school. After I continued to Milan, to Milan, in the Instituto Maragoni, I took a lot for personally, mentally, everything. I like Italian philosophy, we are very close. I love Greece, it's my country, I don't want to talk bad about Greece. Just Greeks, we have a bad attitude. We have a bad attitude on the street, we have a bad attitude on our relationship with people. I would prefer, I don't know, maybe I'm so romantic, I think it's like here. I would prefer the relations to be more uh, uh, honest. Just what I love in Italy is that uh, they, even the last employee has that taste, has that style. The film was a prologue. Sayomi is a great woman. I know her personally. She's the mother of uh, one of my best friends. Sayomi is a woman that uh, she left her country, Japan, when she was 20, 21, just in one day, she just decided. She met a Cretan guy, sailor. She decided to follow a dream that she didn't even realize it was just her dream. She just did it. She felt her passion lead her to another country, to other people, you know? And at that age, that back like uh, 1960s, almost 70s, she was like a Martian to them. To Cre especially Cretan people who are, uh, uh, you know, very, very traditional. The documentary was a production of Animal, uh, Nikos Dayadas, he is also Cretan, a young, great artist, director. Uh, he trusted me, he allowed me to use the trailer because he believed in my collection. I want to do a special collection for Crete because Crete has a huge tradition. So I want to focus, and I owe, I feel, to focus mm -hmm. one uh, whole collection for Crete. 
That's why I did it a little bit more generally like Mediterranean style. Yeah. So I tried to combine Japanese and Mediterranean and in a, in a nostalgia, nostalgia, it's yes. called the yes. trend, new, new nostalgia, you know, a style. So I used uh, a lot of lace I love, transparencies, floral patterns, uh, a little bit vo Japanese volumes on shoulders, on the waist. I love high waist skirts, pencil skirts, a little bit 50s because of the nostalgia. I wanted to give it like 50s a little bit. I think it was a good collection and as the judges said, it might be good. Yeah.